the reading from Sri Sri Radha Sasanini. First one. Sri Radha's glories. We have come in the commentary to the point of Lakshmi Devi. Yeah. <laughs> the dust of Sri Radha's lotus feet is called Shima or filled with opulences. Shima. Even for the goddess of fortune, Lakshmi Devi, this putta is very difficult to attain. In Srimad Bhagavan, the tenth canto, the wives of the Kaliya snake say that the goddess of fortune gave up the sight of her divine husband Narayan by her own will and took shelter of Vrindavan to perform harsh austerities there, hoping for the foot dust of Sri Krishna. But that until now she has not been able to get. Why not? In Chaitanya Charitamrita Madhya Lila, chapter 8, it's explained. If you worship the Prince of Raj in a reverential mood, without following in the footsteps of the gopis, you will not attain him. <coughs> Lakshmi Devi is the best <coughs> Although she did worship Krishna as the prince of Braj, she did not attain him. No, from beginning. Even for the goddess of fortune, Lakshmi Devi, the footpath is very difficult to attain. In Srimad Bhagavan, the wives of the Kaliya snake say that the goddess of fortune gave up the side of her divine husband Narayan by her own will and took shelter of Vrindavan to perform hard <coughs> austerities there, hoping for the footdust of Sri Krishna. But that until now she has not been able to get it. Why not? If you worship the Prince of Raj in a reverential mood, without following in the footsteps of the gopis, you, you know. will not attain him. One is the reverential mood, worshipping mood, and one is loving mood. with relation. <coughs> what is happening in Bakunta? What is happening in Bakunta is a reverential mood. It's not loving mood there. Everybody is adoring. Why? Because he's a god. He is a Supreme Personality and he not accept this reverential mood. He happy when you make him parallel, <coughs> similar like you, like a friend. He is happy when you become senior and he become your junior. 
Then he left. Means like a son, you you are caring to him. What is the mood of Vrindavan? What is the deity caring? You care to deity like your your friend, like a mother, like a lover. You care. He no care you. You caring. You are cooking for him. You are making the dress for him. That the feelings of atmiya, mane my. You are my. I have to care you. That caring mood is only you will see in Vrindavan. I care you. You care or not care, I don't bother for your caring. <coughs> so Lakshmi is coming only by the gopis' mercy, dust of the gopis, Radhika's mercy. Because this mood is Radhika, that is she care Krishna. What happened to Lakshmi? He is adoring to Narayan, wife of Narayan, very close to Narayan, but he comes to do this in Vrindavan, she is always in Belva. <coughs> because she is not ready to take the dust of gopis. She don't want to surrender. She want direct relation with Narayan without gopis, without Radhika. In, in our devotional life also we do this mistake. We want Krishna, but how to go there? We don't want to take the dust of Vrindavan, dust, dust of gopis. So we also live in the Belavan long time to suffer and do tapasya outside. Even not we are entering in Vrindavan. You understand all English? It's okay? So this is the problem. In our life, we want Krishna, but who's Krishna? If you want Lakshmi Krishna, then you have to go to the Dwaraka. Rukmani Krishna. Then you have to adore because you're interested in opulence of Krishna. The gopis are interested in the naughtiness of Krishna. He is cheater, so the <coughs> gopis are act, love, start loving to him. He's cheating to the heart of us. He's stealing my my clothes, my butter, so they are very attracted with him. <coughs> He is a stealer. This is the beauty of Krishna. He never stands straight. This gopi is attracted. <coughs> when we will know, take the dust of Vrindavan, we know the sweetness of Vrindavan. His naughtiness is attractive. And this is the nature of girls. When somebody is naughty, she attract with that naughtiness. This is the nature of the girls. <laughs> some like naughtiness, some like cheater, some... This is the nature. What is uh, The gopis has nature to attract with this mode of Krishna. So Lakshmi want to adore, gopis want to love. This was the difference. So if I want to love, what we need to do? We have to take the dust of the lovers, of the Krishna. If you want to adore, then different way. But if you want to love Krishna, you have to take the dust of gopis to understand their mercy, how they do that. Yes. We have one question. But uh, uh, in, in uh, can you make little uh, volume low? 
Uh, they are singing very nice, but little low. <laughs> in Brindavan, in, in, in some place, especially Western devotees, looks like uh, they want to introduce in Brindavan by Kunta. Yes, because idea is this. This is the, the actually, you go to the preparatory school, it's very decoration, too much decoration, very attractive. Go to the children, baby schools, very much, all class is full of toys and everything. Very opulence. In America, they have more fees than the normal school for the preparatory school. I don't know Europe. They charge more money for taking care of the babies, taking care of the food. Why? Because to attract them through the opulence. <coughs> but you go to Radha Damoda, Gopinath, Vihariji temple. There is no external opulence. They are opulence in the service and loving exchange. Show is not there. They don't want to show anything to you. You have to realize yourself with your connections. Hmm? For one is the tourist, one is devotee. Vrindavan, many comes as a tour. And many come to know deep of Vrindavan. You remember, I was tourist one day when the first time come. I was looking only opulence. When tourists come, I said, go to see Prem Mandir and it's gone. When I see devotee, I say, go to six, our six devale to see. Because if you send to tourists to six devale, they will not understand. You make very slow, but they are singing nice. You have to arrange prashad for them. <laughs> the 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 opulence, the tourists like, and the devotees like sweetness. You check, Radhe Radhe. They are not interested with opulence. <coughs> and tourists will never understand sweetness. If you send to Radha Kun, they will not understand what Radha Kun. <laughs> First time. Because I see many rivers in Europe and this, and I see Radha Kund, I don't understand. But you ask devotee, Radha Kund, you don't understand? He says, it's my heart. Different. It's my goal of my bhajan. <coughs> So if I came here, I don't take association with Vrijabhazi, I remain in Vaikuntha? Only hundred percent, I the tourist. I come here and I don't meet with Rasik devotees, Vrijabhazi means who is in Rasa, in a mallow. I'm a tourist. When I will meet with the Rasik devotees, then I am not tourist. I become melting, my mood is changing. This is the effect of the Sadhu Sangha.
one is sitting outside of Vrindavan, looking nicely, searching opulence. In the group of Lakshmi, one is in the Vrindavan, they test the Vrindavan. We are in Vrindavan, but we are sitting outside only to look opulence and direct to catch Krishna without mercy of Radhika or gopis. One mood is this. And one mood is this, I want to take shelter of gopis and Radhika and I want to feel Krishna in their mood. Understand? Both are good. But when you see through the eyes of lover, is a beautiful mood. Like if you see the eyes of Jesus <coughs> to his father, is a beautiful father. Because Jesus knows how beautiful his father is. This is the eyes of the Jesus to see the father. From her, his feeling, you have to see the Father. Similarly, if you see in your eyes, you will not see Father, you will see God. Right or not? Yes. You cannot see Father because you have no eyes of Jesus. Same thing, my dear. Here also applied. If you not take the eyes of gopis, not take the dust of gopis, you will see God, not Krishna. Lovers can give you that eyes to see Krishna in this relationship, Malo. <coughs> like this, Mohan, small baby. You have to see the eyes of mother, feeling of mother, then you will relate with this baby. Then if not, then you will say, oh, this is the, her baby. <laughs> this is the point. So you have to see the gopi's eyes to Krishna is a beautiful. The dust of Krishna. Understand? <laughs> heart and eyes. I say eyes, but really not eyes only. Heart of gopis. <laughs> then the ear is like a gopi's ear. Only gopis want to listen about Krishna. <laughs> Eyes is fixed, heart is fixed, fixed, ear is fixed, talking is fixed. One lover can fix only with his beloved. That is the goal of love. So here, Prabodha and Sarasatu want to show you two way. One way is a love way, and love come under lovers if you want to start living. And one is your knowledge, your intelligence, and opulence way. You read thousands of books, <laughs> but love will never come. Your knowledge will grow, false ego will grow, and you will create more blockage in love, because mind will create doubts not to love because you have many knowledge about that, how much problems coming in the love. <laughs> but you ask from the heart of lover, 
He said, there is any problem is no problem for me. What is the problem? You never test the love, so you feel problem. You have no real love. You don't want to sacrifice yourself, so you are in problem. You ask from the Jesus heart. He has so many problems, but he never feel problem because it was intense love with his father. Similarly, Gopis was so much intense love with Krishna, nothing bothered. Hmm? Understand? Yes. Clear the difference? Is clear? Go on. Gopi Anugati Vina Aishwarya Gyan Bajileo Nai Pai Bradyandra Nandana. If you worship the Prince of Raj in a reverential mood, without following in the footsteps of the Gopis, you will not attain him. Lakshmi Devi is the best that's, example. That of is very nice. Read again. Bangla also? Yeah, Bangla I explained. Gopi Anugati Vina Aishwarya Gyan. Without <coughs> taking shelter of Gopi, you will never come out from the Aishwarya Gyan. Opulence, rituals, worshipping, you will never go. Because Without taking shelter of the rasika, up, you have to be in appearance, God reverence. You cannot go to say he is not God. You join Krishna because he is a God. <coughs> now, if you want to love, you have to forget that he is a God. If you don't forget that he is a God, then you cannot give, make small to him. He is a parallel or smaller than you? How the small mother, baby is a small, mother is high. Mother is always bigger than baby. If Krishna is a Gopal, he's a small baby. The friend, if he's not parallel, how Krishna become horse? He will always win because he's a god, he will win. And the all always his friend will lose the game because he's a god. He says, I forget that I am a god, I am your friend. And I will lose that I will make you happy because you are my friend. This is penalty. Conjugal love. Who is more important in conjugal love? Boy or girl? Girl is more important. He controls to his lover. She, she controls she control to his lover. Her lover. How she say, the man dance like that. <laughs> he said, I want to see your dance before I will hug you. He will start dancing because he need <laughs> You, this cloth is very dirty, you have to change fresh cloth, take bath, then come to me. <laughs> he will do like that. <laughs> what he, the my girl will say, boy will do. <laughs> so who is controlling? Girl is controlling to the boy, a boy is controlling to the girl. 
So similarly, Radhika is controlling to the Krishna. <laughs> Not that Krishna is controlling to the Radhika. He is not God there. You see, he is crying to take the feet of Radhika. Oh, give me mercy and love to me. You give me mercy and love to me. I am very dry. I am not fixed one pointed. You are fixed one pointed. So, so loves move when you forget that he is a God. If you remember God, it will not be not go. You will adore all the time. And anartha will always stay there. Anartha will not nivrit. Listen, anartha nivrti, then bhakti will come. Raga bhakti will come. Are Narayan Maharaj say only greed you need. If you have a greed, all your anartha will go. To take the shelter of the dust of Radhika, your all anartha will go. Love has big power. Why Mahaprabhu comes to give that love in our life? We cannot change our anartha, our nature, human body, and my senses is full of anartha. Prem bhakti jaha hoyte avidya vinash jayte. When prem bhakti will come in our life, all ignorance automatic will go. Prem bhakti is the base. Gopi Anugati Vina Aishwarya Gyan Badileo Nai Pai Brajendra Nandana. If I will chant about Krishna twenty years, thirty years, but you will get the Krishna, but in Dwarika Krishna. In Kurukshetra Krishna. This is Narayan Krishna. He is not Brajendra Nandan, he is not Radhika's Krishna. If you want Radhika's Krishna, you have to take shelter of Radhika. Hmm? Without taking shelter of Radhika, not possible. Hmm? Yes? Understand? Clear or not? Gopi Anugati Vina Shvaya Gyan Bajile Nahi Pai Brajandra Nandana Tahate Tristanta Lakshmi Kurila Brajana Tatapi Na Paila Brajya Brajandra Nandana If you worship the Prince of Raj in a reverential mood, Without following in the footsteps of the gopis, you will not attain him. Lakshmi Devi is the best example of that. Although she did worship Krishna as the prince of Raj, she did not attain him. And that's right. The Lord's greatest devotee, Uddhava Mahashaya, was astonished when he saw the greatness of the gopis' love for Krishna. Now you take second example. One is Lakshmi, one is Uddhava. 
Now Uddhava, you see, he is living with Krishna. He is the wearing the same dress after he Krishna leave Uddhava wear, wear. And he look like Krishna. Same color. Sleeping together, eating together, doing all things together. And he is the one of the knowledgeable person in Vedas and Puranas because he is the son of Vrihaspati. Huh? No? So he is not less knowledgeable with the Vedas and Purana, full knowledge. So Krishna one day say, one day he is crying, Krishna tears. He said, Krishna, why you cry? For why you? I am very worried about the Brajvasis in Vrindavan. They are very ignorant, they are not very educated. My mother is also not very educated. She always cries for me. And my friends, <coughs> gopis, they are crying. My Radhika is always thinking for me. And you are the best pundit of philosopher. You can go and teach them. Because you know all Vedas, Puranas, about the Paramatma, Brahma and Bhagavan. And you know me also. So you have to go and teach them. You know that. What happened when Uddhava went to the Vrindavan? He wants to teach them and they reject him. They say, what you come to teach me? You learn from me. Because Krishna, we are the lover of the Krishna. And we are loving now and he never go out from me. We feel separation from him, but we are in love of them. So Uddhav say, I want to become dust of Vrindavan. I want to be a clipper of Vrindavan, not tree. Clipper means always dust come to me. I want to be always in the dust of the gopi's feet. I want to take this dust, how much they have love for Krishna. So you see Uddhava living with Krishna, knowledgeable with Krishna, but no love for Krishna. So what we need in our life, bhakti. Bhakti is, means prem bhakti. This is the mercy of Prabhupada. He sent to Vrindavan to learn this prema bhakti. Hmm? This is the mercy of our Guru Vargas. They sent us here to understand this. Yes? Love is important than knowledge. Understand? Yes. Yes, Jananda? Yes. What is the use to become Uddhava if I have no prayer for Krishna? <laughs> Living together, sleeping together, but no understand nicely. No love generate inside. Why? Because he no surrendered to the dust of gopis. He no put it on his head. Lovers association is important. Not jnani association is important. Not karmi association is important. <laughs> Yeah. 
Radhe Radhe Didi. Radhe Radhe. Welcome, welcome. Radhe. Come sit here. Mere I am very, very, very sorry. I I cannot go yesterday because oh, I we feel were so, so down. disappointed. Today I will sure come. Yes, good. Sure come. Everyone left. Yes, <laughs> yes, really. They wanted to hear you. My God, <laughs> what I will say? <laughs> I don't know. They are so so knowledgeable. Yes, they speak very well, but you speak from the heart, and that's what everybody is waiting to hear. That's <laughs> exactly what he was saying just now. Yeah, you know, the difference between John and John. what is it? They're all saying very good things. Nuts. What? What the? It didn't go wrong. Chitti ke liye, unse ukko paro marche ka mundra. Acha. Baba, sab ko naam leka hai. Acha, ठीक है, आएगा तब. Are you feeling good, good today? Good. Yeah. Very nice. Better. She, two, three person healing, and one, two hour after, I feel good. Oh, that's wonderful. My, I feel that I cannot breathe. It is was so heavy. So we are talking about the. Gopi, eh? Gopi, lotus feet, dust. How important in our life? Radhika's dust is so important. Why? Because if I don't take dust, dust of Radhika or Gopis, then our mood will become Aishwarya. <coughs> we will go in the group of uh, Lakshmi. Like sitting in the bell bus, we coming in Vrindavan, but we are adoring like a god to Krishna. My relation will not develop by the dust of the gopis putting head. I can come in relationship with Krishna. One relation mellow will come in my life. My life will change. You see, all this what Prabhupada write in page four, if you read in Bhagavad Gita about the relation, is the all the goal for that. The relation you develop, things change. I give this example to Jesus' life. His relation makes him so divine. With his father, you give me one example from the Bible. He said that he is a god. He always say, "My father, my father." And when he say to the supreme lord, "My father," means all his family. So if one eh, Radhika is telling my Krishna. Then all the Krishnas, all creation, she has to care. Why she take care of us? Because she is the giver of the love. Love come from the goddess of love. She is Radhika. We need this love to give to Krishna. We are empty man. We are empty pocket. We have no love inside. We are dry up. We become like a dry leaf. No rasa is there. So dry leaf only knows to fall down. But the the green leaf never fall down from the tree because is the rasa is there. So if you want to be in rasa, you will become green. If not, then dry leaf will fall down. This is the nature of this body. How does Goranga fit into all of this? Goranga, Goranga is the only source who make the full of rasa. I want to hear more. Yes, you see. <coughs> Goranga is Radhika. This our nature 
It's not very easy to forget my bodily consciousness. So Krishna say how to help in Kali Yuga? Kali Yuga is a nature to enjoy material thing, na? And you are Radhika, without your taking shelter, they will never understand me. He say, I will do this. I will become male, Radhika say. I will, I, Radhika, become male, Gauranga. Gaurangi means Radhika. And Shantadhar heart. Just I say about Gauranga. So Gauranga say, okay, I will become male. If they are in the bodily consciousness, they don't want to go to realize the soul or sarup or these things. But if they will come, my association, they will change themselves. Because Gauranga is only talking about Krishna. Who can talk? Krishna. Krishna will talk about him. Krishna will talk about Radhika. Krishna will talk about Mother Yasoda. Krishna will talk about his friend. You see, Srimad Bhagavat. But Gauranga in Chaitanya Chaitamrit always talking about Krishna. Ha ah, Krishna. Ha ah, Krishna. Who can do this? Only Radhika. You read Chaitanya Chaitamrit, always talking about Krishna. Even in the fourth chapter, Adi Lila is very clearly written, the foolish child can understand Brajendra Nandan. So what is the qualification? To become foolish and to become childish. To understand Brajendra Nandan. Why? And he never accepts that Krishna is killing any demons. Whole life we study that all Krishna kill all demons. But in Adi Lila 4 Canto, Chaitanya Chaita Amrita is written, this is not a work of Krishna who kills any demons. Right or not? Why? Because this is Radhika can say only. This was different Krishna, Narayan. Krishna ordered to Narayan to kill this. My Krishna, why he will kill to anyone? <laughs> This is not his job to kill. He come to love. He come to exchange the love. Why to kill anyone? <laughs> so beautiful. Chaitanya Chaitamrit is so beautiful. Mahaprabhu and Raya Ramanand is meeting. They start rolling there by meeting. Why? Because Radhika is looking, looking he sees my Visakha. And Visakha is looking, oh, I am meeting after long time to Radhika. <laughs> they start rolling. They don't understand they are Ramananda or Mahaprabhu. They start rolling, crying like so much ecstasy, so much happiness. If you remember your friend from long time, and you see and you remember, you cannot stop. You will be in an ecstasy madness. This madness comes. <coughs> that Karamkandi was there in the river with the Ramananda Rai. He said, oh, they are crazy. Why this uh, sannyasi is rolling to see the king? He has some business, money business to take something. Different idea because they are in that consciousness. Other thing, oh, this king is why rolling with this looking. They don't understand what is the hidden pastime there. These are the Karamkandis people. They are, they are the Baidi Bhakta. They will never understand Raga Bhaktas, devotees. All, many pastimes, every part, 
past time you see is a hidden meaning in Chaitanya Chaitanya. It's a full of rasa. Now you start with Gajada. You see the Gajada is a Radha Shakti. Shakti of Radhika. What is the Shakti of Radhika? Prem. Love is the Shakti of Radhika. Radhika is always with Krishna, but he do the service every place in that verse. <coughs> you see, any animals, if you love animals, he will give you love. Dog, cat, rat, any animal. So this energy of prem is there in animals also. If you see the plants, tree, grass, anything, by love it will become more growing. If you care, if you give little water, you like this, this plant will grow. So is, that, is that how I should treat the mice in my room? <laughs> Maybe I will stop eating my dish towels. <laughs> that, that is the point that devotees in Vrindavan, they know they are destroying, but they cannot do. They don't know what to do. <laughs> this is the problem in Vrindavan. They bring something to catch and throw outside, but they get up like this, they are playing. They cannot do because of this nature grow up. But you see in America, Europe, what they will do, they are immediately finished. <laughs> Actually, the nature change. In love, the nature change. This is the point. So this is the Radha Shakti praise. Whole inverse is in the influence by Radha Shakti. So where is Krishna in Mahaprabhu? Mahaprabhu Krishna is relishing the Radha's prayer. He's, he come to relish that. He is hidden. One time Mahaprabhu listen that Nityananda uh, one Jagai Madhai throw the stone on the head. So he was very upset. He ran and he went. And it's a chakra. Chakra. Nityananda catch his hand. What you are doing? You promised this time that you will only change by love. Why are you calling this time? In Radhika, Krishna become more opulent. You know? Krishna is also there. Krishna is a chakra. chakra. You say, you cannot do. You cannot change by killing someone. This is over. You can change by love to someone. That is the way. <laughs> so this is the Mahaprabhu great must. And really in this life, what Prabhupada do? We change by love. What Narayan Maharaj is doing? Change by love. Two minutes, five minutes, but all change by love. Love is the key to change. This is the Gauravani Pracharya. This is to be Gauravani Pracharya. One thing Mahaprabhu, he no talk much, he do in his life to show others how to move in life. We are talking much, doing nothing. <laughs> talking something, doing something. Why you do? I mean, everything is for preaching for others, not for me. 
अरे भैया इफ आई नो चेंज माई सेल्फ वाई टू प्रीच वाई टू से टू अदर्स फर्स्ट आई हैव टू चेंज लाइफ विल चेंज इफ आई कैन चेंज माई लाइफ देन अदर विल गेट द एग्जाम्पल टू चेंज दैम सेल्फ This is Gauravad. This is he come to say. That's what everyone wanted to hear last night. Yeah. Yeah. Today <laughs> I will come. I will say, Mahaprabhu, I love Mahaprabhu. I will show the importance of Panchatat. From where you are coming? Croatia and Bosnia. Bosnia. In Croatia. Wow, very good. And you from? Bosnia. Ah, where you are staying? In Warsaw. This number. It's called. Wow. Bosnia, you know? Pujari, 25 years. Oh, yeah, Pujari. Yeah. Mataji is preaching. Very nice. Mataji is also from Bosnia. Croatia. Croatia. Oh, you know all of them. No. I'm not... He's also from Croatia. One time you come in temple in Zagreb. Yes, I was there. Mr. Krishna Maharaj. He is my very good friend. Yeah, this is my mentor. He has connect for you, you for him. Yeah. Mahasa to tell me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mataji was there, right? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Sumita Krishna Maharaj, Radhanath Swami, very good friend. And Sachinandan Maharaj, they are very good. Very. Yes. Dhanurdhar Maharaj. Dhanurdhar Maharaj, this I know. Oh, wow, Jai. जय 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 You see, your Guru Dev is hiding here. Why? Because of that, Radha dust. <laughs> he cannot say it is God, but he is doing that. Full time only chant, 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 chanting and woman. Only Sadhu Vaishnava dust. He changed when he come here. He don't want to see. <laughs> <laughs> the empire thinks he want to go for his bhajan <laughs> prabhupad gift you see, you see they are gifted by prabhupad mahanidhi maharaj now he been more deep in <coughs> he can leave prabhupad all his mercy he, he got he has to go to hire bhajan step by step everybody progress in life it's all progress all progress no one can travel in the world without mercy of prabhupada all are blessed by prabhupada going out of india and prabhu path 
I I show you one line of Prabhupada. If you understand, life will change. Show Bhagavad Gita. You ask, she is the Prabhupada disciple, senior most. No, you read, it's no light, she cannot read. Show him that. Page four, first is, uh, thing, he say, relation twenty-one times. You have to develop relation. Passive relation will not work. If you want, develop relation with Krishna. Second thing he say, uh, read Prabhupada's words. <coughs> Bhagavad Gita is this introduction, page four. Translate Mataji to her. Yes. Here the Lord clearly tells Arjuna that he is making him the first receiver of a new parampara. It's important or not much? Because the old succession was broken. It was the Lord's wish, therefore, to establish another parampara in the same line of thought that was coming down from the Sun God to others. And it was His wish that His teaching be distributed anew by Arjuna. He wanted Arjuna to become the authority in understanding the Bhagavad Gita. So we see that Bhagavad Gita is instructed to Arjuna, especially because Arjuna was a devotee of the Lord, a direct student of Krishna, and his intimate friend. You see, you are devotee, you are direct student of your Gurudev, but not intimacy with Krishna. That only missing point. Intimate friend of Krishna means relation with Krishna. Therefore, Bhagavad Gita is best understood by a person who has qualities similar to Arjuna's. That is to say, he must be a devotee in a direct relationship with the Lord. Direct relationship. As soon as one becomes a devotee of the Lord, he also has a direct relationship <coughs> with the Lord. Well, that is a very elaborate subject matter. But briefly, it can be stated that a devotee is in a relationship with the Supreme, Supreme Personality of Godhead in one of five different ways. ways. One may be a devotee in a passive state. You know passive? What? Food. Huh? Food. 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 No, it's morality. Yeah. Passive means, sir, like shopping, go to the shopping, you have no relation with the shopman. You pay and take money. So you have only business where the cheap price you will get, you will get it. So there are many God we are shopping to the God where is the best, I will get it. Huh? This is the shopping. Passive means shopping. Fruit is the different thing. But shopping is meaning a passive, this. Because we have no relation with the shopman. Second. Second. One may be a devotee in an active state. Mm. Active means we are devotee as a brahmachari is active state. Mm. Third. One may be a devotee as a friend. Uh -huh. Fourth, one may be a devotee as a parent. Uh 
And fifth, one may be a devotee as a conjugal lover. Yeah. Arjuna was in a relationship with the Lord as friend. Of course, there is a gulf of difference between this friendship and the friendship found in the material world. This is transcendental friendship, which cannot be had by everyone. Of course, everyone has a particular relationship with the Lord, and that relationship is evoked by the perfection of devotional service. But in the present status of our life, not only have we forgotten the Supreme Lord, but we have forgotten our eternal relationship with the Lord. Every living being, out of the many, many billions and trillions of living beings, has a particular relationship with the Lord eternally. That is called Swarup. By the process of devotional service, one can revive that Svarupa. And that stage is called Svarupa Siddhi. What is Svarupa? Sarup is the form. Sarup means form. Form of the Lord, Krishna's form, and my form. If my form, my spiritual form, is not revoked, then what will happen? I will be without form spiritually, like a light. Soul is like a light. And his form is there, I see that. But without my form, it will not relate because it's a Mayavad philosophy. Mayavad has no form. If he is no form, I see, and I know see my form is totally Mayavad. If I see his form and I don't see my form, he's half of Mayavad. And if I see his form, and I see my form is a is a personal is a is a bhakti life. Maharaj, some people will think that Krishna is is loving to them in their present material form, and when they pray to Krishna, they're thinking he is responding to them in their material form. It's not working. No, but how do you? Because say Krishna is a supreme personality. Because he, Devi Devta you can do with material form. You can make the Shiva happy, Shakti happy with the material form. You can make a Durga happy, Saraswati happy, Ganesha happy with this material body. To Krishna, why is he uh, supreme? Because you have to move from High, higher stage to move for him. He is a supreme Lord. For Radha and Krishna, we cannot go through material consciousness. Durga, Shiva, Saraswati, all devtas, you can go there. But when, when someone is praying, uh, for instance, a child kneeling down by their bed and saying, a prayer mm -hmm. to the Lord, mm -hmm. they have no idea mm -hmm. that they are not that body. Mm -hmm. So, but the Lord is still hearing them. The baby, you know, when they born the baby, they smile and they do, because they don't know about the body. They never eat the outside grain. To impurity is not there. Then when the skin is a chitta vritti, is a chatrahi, they all are pure. They have no touch impurity inside here. 
their mind is not disturbing, their no senses are disturbing, they are in the pure stage. So the physical body is also in pure stage. They can see, they can relate. But we mix so much by eating and thinking and using my senses, it becomes impure. So to come out from this impurity, I can see directly. He is not far, he is always in the front of me. Because of the covering, we cannot see Krishna. You can see Shiva, you can do worship, you can do worship of Sakti, Durga, all devtas are very easy to approach. Ganesha, you listen one time Ganesha is drinking milk with every hand. It's very easy. But Krishna, you can go to the temple of Shiva to of put everything in his head, but you cannot enter in Krishna temple because we are not pure to touch him. But one devotee who has a deity and he is in love, he can touch and do anything. It's a love touching him. That. If that type of intense love, then this spiritual identity it becomes chatrahi, in and out all become pure in the love. <coughs> because there is no other desire left there. Unknowingly we realize our sarup that I am in this mood of him. But it's the unknowing, unknowing is all work. Relation make to change our life. We may also have from previous lifetime. Uh, oh, Mar Narayan Maharaj right? This is the previous sanskar. Without no efforts, it comes revoke in your life because you already done that practice. Same thing is coming out now to you. Right, I agree this. One place he is writing that at the time of initiation you got the realization. Mm -hmm. And it, uh, many happen after initiation you got in different stage of realization. Initiation is process till you don't revoke yourself. <coughs> you see, Sarup and Sarup Siddhi. There is no right to f only to follow institution or this or that or follow me. He said, this is the goal. Sarup and Sarup Siddhi is the instruction. His introduction is so divine. Everything he give, all Vedas, Puranas conclude there in his introduction. How you can change? This has to do for perfection. Siddhi means perfection. Perfection of one's constitutional position. Yeah. Not Krishna's constitutional position, your constitutional position, you have to perfect in that. He is fixed also. <coughs> First form, then relationship and feelings. And if you develop your for relation, form will come as per relation. That is devotion. 
relation make you to develop that form. Intense greed. Everything will happen. Anything happen in your life, first make chance from that way. Don't wait after this, after this, after this. Not rule is there. Maybe you realize in past life something and you are jump out more. Nobody can assess about it. <coughs> but your constitutional position, my constitutional position is important to fix my sarup, that sarup. And that siddhi is important. <coughs> and all Mahajan is talking about that. And he writes in page 4. Why not, you see, if you four twenty years before? What did you? What? You are not reading Bhagavad Gita? <laughs> you are not searching, you are not philo uh, uh, pe researching? I was thinking this with direct relationship to Krishna is too high. <laughs> but not to have a direct relationship with Krishna is too low. Yeah. It's too long. That is the point. Why not reach for the stars? <laughs> Why not? How can you have a direct relationship if you don't want, if you think it's too high or too low or whatever? You need to want it very badly. Otherwise, I can hear Because they were warning, don't try, they don't try for this high Krishna Leela. Who was warning? Devotees who were... Ali, he write in page four. If you write in last page, then you have to do after that. I have my guru there. He gave me Radhadas. And he's everything I know. I don't know anything but my guru. If he tells me the level of greed, one for it, it's what I do. Nothing else. I say the, the develop the greed what Prabhupada writes. In this all will come. Everything is there. Nothing is out and there. Sambandha, avideha and paryojan all in this page. Sambandha, relation, avideha, Rupa Goswami and paryojana is Raghunath Das Goswami. All three he write in one page. I have my guru that why should I think about what's higher or low? No, that is also wrong. <laughs> then it will be fanatic. You are Easter there. Where is the written about Guru there? You see Prabhupada, where is right about Guru there? We say he learned, but the, he is the way. Jesus also said, Guru is the way. He will navigate us, show you. But you have to reach always goal, Sarup, your identity, and his identity. Radha Krishna, nothing else. Yes, following the instructions of my Guru. But that, that is the written. All Mahajans write that. So if you make priority to Gurudev, then this will miss. Priority is this. I show you this is the priority. So you have to think this is the priority. Radha Mohan is my priority. And my constitutional position is my priority. 
If this is there, you all said, then you listen me. Yes. That is the point. When I am there, <laughs> I will. If you are really fixed there, then you will see me there in my siddha there. With sadhak deha you will not see. When you will know your constitutional position, then you will see me there. And you will search me, this body, it will not get, see there. <laughs> so, <laughs> where is the thing? <laughs> From the first moment you were saying this thing. Yeah. And I understood like that. that my is. Ishta Deva following the instruction of my Guru. Huh? We should be fixed in our Ishta Deva, following the instruction of Guru Deva. Ah, instruction to develop your form, yes. constitutional form, is my instruction. Yes. Over that, you have to work. I will not do anything. <laughs> I will make you circumstances that it become favorable, but doing is your job. <laughs> Yes, it's very clear. <coughs> that is not easy also. <laughs> <laughs> so now it's dekite, dekite. Mm, yeah. So never mention my name. <laughs> I navigate you and yes, stop. <laughs> <laughs> I show you. <laughs> That's how Guru is one. Yeah, yeah. It's nothing. It's one small servant of Radhika, Krishna. That's it. How is it possible to have a, a relationship without a form? Never. never. <laughs> Two bulbs are living here, they have no relation, they never, I see, talking, <laughs> no looking at each other. They are giving light, one is small, like a soul, I put small, and one I put super soul, <laughs> big light. So looking, they are no in relation. Soul and super soul are there, but no relation. Brahma Bhut Prasannatma, both are there. One is sparking, one is lighting big, but no relation. <laughs> but they are both are happy. Sometime you can use them, sometime use them. Brahma Bhut Prasannatma. And they make happy to us also with their light. <laughs> But Bhagavan can give this vision to be seen form. Not in our 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 Vedic place you can see this. You but there are many Vedic philosophy, but this is the mercy of Chaitanya that he opened this vision of the constitutional position to fix. And when I see Mahaprabhu, great mercy, I see many sampradaya, they have known this. This is the great mercy of Mahaprabhu. What you say, Gauravani Pracharne, this prachar is the important prachar for Mahaprabhu. That to fix your constitutional position. This book is important in evening time. Gauravani Pracharne, Prabhupada mercy. This is Gaurvani Prasad. This Mahaprabhu give only in Gaurya Siddhanta. I know many Rasik Vaishnavas here, they are not practicing this. <coughs> also, but Siddhanta Maharaj, he says, without a form you cannot relate to the Supreme. Can you show me? I don't believe without books. You have to keep all books of Bhakti <laughs> He has one book. Can you take out? I Show something. I will see it if it is here. Yes. You have to take care of the books. 
is a very important book. Yes. 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 Y